Hi children, welcome back again. Okay, in this video we are going to discuss about the next chapter. That is, uh, I think the third chapter, um, types of houses. Already we have learned what is house, how many uh, parts are there for a house and uh, how many rooms are there in a house, for what purpose those particular rooms are used. These all things we have learned in the last video. So in this video we are learning about the types of houses. Even though we have the house is the same for everyone. But it is different in the shape, size and the yeah, shape and the size. Uh, depending upon their shapes and the materials, how the uh, those materials are used to construct a house. So, uh, depending upon that, we uh, divide into the types of houses. For example, what is a house? We know that even for a human being, for animals, for um, animals like uh, uh, dog, horse and uh, some other domestic animals like cow, buffalo, for these also we have the houses, sheds and the garages like this. Even for us also we have the building called as a house with the many rooms. And then, so for the types of houses we have first, uh, there are some types of houses like kacha house, pakka house and um, uh, okay, kacha house and the pakka house. Then what are these kacha houses and the pakka houses? Kacha houses means the houses which are built for the temporary reason or tem on the temporary base. For example, the houses in the villages and all you can see there will be a sticks. They have uh, made sticks like this on, on that we they have uh, done some um, like mud and all they have kept uh, like this they have done the polish from the mud and all. And even these houses, kacha houses are built by using the mud, straw and the wood. And these are not at all permanent. After some years or after some days, those are going to fall down and those are going to destroy by themselves only, by the rain, by the sun hot, like this. So these houses are, we, we are building these houses. Not now, but uh, before very poor people who they don't have the money to purchase cement and all. They used to build like this. Nowadays it's not possible. Everyone are building the house. But um, those days it was like this. And like this kacha houses we can build in the farm for a temporary reason. Because we are not going to stay there for permanent. So for some temporary reason we, are, we will be there. Uh, like in the farm and all we are building this kacha houses. Kacha houses are not permanent. They are built with using mud, straw and the wood. And next we have the pakka house. Pakka house means what? It's a permanent. Pakka house. It's a permanent. Permanently we can build a house by using cement, bricks and the iron. You know that this RCC buildings and all these all will come under the pakka houses. And even in the pakka houses also we have some types like bungalows, multi-stored houses, big building will be there of uh, number of floors there ground floor first second like this hundreds together in bombay and all we can see a multi-stored house and uh, okay so in the pakka house we have of oh, um, bungalows are there multi-stored house are there flat system is there so we, like this we can call in a yeah we can differentiate in the pakka houses uh, for example a uh, house with a lot of designs, big house, lot many things or lot many rooms in that and it has a, its own compound, it has its own design, it, it has its own, uh, has got a big house, uh, sorry, big place for that. So like that big house we call as a bungalow, palace like this, bungalow actually, palace is not possible for us to live, bungalow we can call. Uh, if suppose in cities and all, Bombay, Delhi, like this, in commercial cities, there they don't have place. See, in the village we have place to build a long like this, to build a gate there, to build a compound there, to um, uh, even we have a place for lot many things downside only. So we will not go for the next um, uh, stage building. So we will use it like it rely uh, the this place only, ground place only. But in cities and all, there the place will be not sufficient for to do all the things because place will city will be small and number of people will be more. So in that area, what they will do, they will do 
construct house upon house another one house another one is like this the uh, 10 or 12 uh, floors will be there or hundreds together floors will be there for that type of building we call as a even your school also you can see first floor second floor ground first second and third floor like this we will have so the build, like this building we call as a multi store buildings so in this multi store building each house is considered as the flat See children, we have discussed in this uh, video that uh, the types of houses, what is house, types of houses and even we have, we know the names for the houses in a different place. So, uh, before ending this, I would like to give you two questions that uh, what are pakka houses and what are kacha houses. You can write definition for this. So, in the next video, we are going to discuss about the different houses, where the different houses are there and how they are. Okay, so I hope you'll enjoy this video. Let us meet in the next video. Till then, take care of yourself. Bye-bye.